Classification of Electronic Components All electronic circuits contain few basic components that are three passive components and two active components. An integrated circuit may comprise of thousands of transistors, few capacitors on a small chip. The electronic components are classified broadly as passive and active components. Now let's look into the passive components. Resistors, capacitors and inductors are called as passive components. These electronic components are called passive because they by themselves are not capable of amplifying or processing an electrical circuit. However, passive components are as important as active components in any electronic circuit. Resistors The component that opposes the flow of current is called a resistor. This opposing force is called the resistance of the material. It is measured in ohms. Capacitors Capacitor is a component that is used to store electrical energy and release them whenever desired. It is measured in farads. Capacitors like resistors can either be fixed or variable. Some common capacitors are mica, ceramic, paper and air gun capacitors. Inductor The electronic component which produces inductance is called an inductor. The inductance is measured in henrys. All inductors like resistors and capacitors are listed as fixed and variable. Active Components Active components are used in electronic circuits. They are classified in two categories, tube devices and semiconductor devices. Due to many advantages of semiconductor devices, they are replacing tube devices in many electronic applications. These components rely on a source of energy and are able to control the electron flow through them. Some of these components are semiconductors like diodes, transistors, integrated circuits, various displays like LCD, LED, CRTs, and power source like batteries and other AC and DC supply sources. Diodes A diode is a device that allows current to flow in one direction and usually made with semiconductor material. It has two terminals, anode and cathode terminals. These are mostly used in converting circuits like AC to DC circuits. These are of different types like PN diodes, Zener diodes, LEDs, photodiodes, etc. Transistors A transistor is a three terminal semiconductor device. Mostly, it is used as switching device and also as an amplifier. This switching device can be a voltage or current controlled. By controlling the voltage applied to one terminal controls the current flow through the other two terminals. The transistors are of two types, namely bipolar junction transistor BJT and field effect transistor FET. And further, these can be PNP and NPN transistors. Integrated Circuits An integrated circuit is a special component which is fabricated with thousands of transistors, resistors, diodes and other electronic component on a tiny silicon chip. These are the building blocks of current electronic devices like cell phones, computers, etc. These can be analog or digital integrated circuits. Mostly used ICs in electronic circuit are OP amps, timers, comparators, switches ICs and so on. These can be classified as linear and non-linear ICs depending on its application. Display devices LCD A liquid crystal display 
is a flat display technology which is mostly used in application like computer monitors, cell phone displays, calculators, etc. This technology uses two polarized filters and electrodes for selectively disable or enable the light to the eyes of the viewer. CRT cathode ray tube display technology is mostly used in televisions and computer screens that works on the movement of an electron beam back and forth on the back of the screen. This tube is an elongated vacuum tube in which flattened surface has external components as electron gun, electron beam and a phosphorescent screen. Batteries Batteries are most common power source for standalone, industrial, domestic and handheld device applications. It converts chemical energy into electrical energy through the electrochemical discharge reactions. These consist of one or more cells and each cell contains an anode, cathode and electrolyte. The battery cells are classified into two types namely primary cells and secondary cells. The primary cells are not of rechargeable type but the secondary cells can be rechargeable. Thank you.